Two sisters, a nurse and a teacher started their dream business this year despite a series of COVID related setbacks. The Buttermilk Sky Pie Shop finally opened in Huntersville last month. WCNC Charlotte's Michelle Bowden shows us how this family business figured out where's the money. This is a sweet story, literally, about a pie shop, a family business, and a pandemic, and the way this family just wouldn't quit no matter what 2020 threw at them. Starting your own business is about as American as apple pie. I think pie has always been the thing. Um, it's very traditional, and um, it's something that we relate a lot with memories. Gabby Silman and her sister Savannah Lape love pie so much, they started saving money as a teacher and a nurse, respectively, with plans of opening the Buttermilk Sky Pie Shop in Huntersville in May 2020. Uh, we were nervous, and a lot of people have said, you know, you're so brave to open during a pandemic. It took more than bravery to get past the hurdles the two faced. Unfortunately, our construction had this Become, come to a complete halt um, in last March, and we didn't begin until the end of August, uh, which then going in, um, it took us a long time to get permits. The city was backed up. Uh, it, it definitely was a struggle. There were financial struggles too. We had um, an SBA loan secured, and unfortunately when the pandemic hit, that quickly went away, and we had to start that process over. And at one point we looked at each other and we were like, are we really doing this? Are we really gonna open a pie shop? They didn't have to look too far for motivation. Our grandfathers and my dad, our dad, um, all own small businesses, and it was something that meant a lot to us and something we could do together as a family. Um, and it's you know definitely a family thing. Every all of our family is in here working all the time. The sisters finally opened almost a year later than expected, but Gabby says they opened on what turned out to be the perfect opening day. It was Pie Day. This community has shown up for small businesses and they've shown up to support new concepts and uh, new ideas. And it's been really exciting. I mean, we have had lines and lines off the door um, for people coming in to support us and try us. The best selling pie may be not a huge surprise here. They say it is the granny apple and they can't keep it in stock. Reporting in Charlotte, Michelle Bowden, WCNC Charlotte.